Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Maina Njenga's statement in Kitui County during a Thanksgiving ceremony of the Senate of Kitui, that is Wabua, Maina Njenga is coming out to reveal certain secret cards, and this is something that is significant politically speaking. When look at this time where Rigadi Gashagwa is busy trying to unite Mount Kenya region behind William Samoe Ruto, Maina Njenga is coming out that he is like a tool to test the waters in Mount Kenya region. When he started, he started all the way from Kenon Stadium, Murana County, where he came out calling for a main conference. And it was so successful. When look at even the way he was well received, this was a storm that signalized that Maina Njenga was trying to indicate and try to understand is still UDA a storm in Mount Kenya region. Secondly, Maina Njenga went directly to Ruiru, Kiambu County, where when look at the way he was received, you could understand the kind of politics that is there and secret cards that now Maina Njenga is coming out to reveal to us. As the issue of Kalonzo also, Maina Njenga has come out also to reveal to, the, to Kenyans that this is something that is there and we are having a road somewhere that Kalonzo Msioka is likely going to be the candidate of Azimiola Umoja One Kenya coalition in the next general election. And the practice and the secret cards that they are playing, they are going to ensure that William Ruto, together with his UDA brigade, they are going to be kicked out from Mount Kenya region and also across several parts of the Republic of Kenya. And Maina Njenga came out saying this. Tunasema ni vibaya sana. Kama watu wameishi hapa miaka na miaka, alafu unakuja kubomolea mtu, unambomolea kwa nini? Lazima wapatie pahali pengine pakui, pakuishi. Sindio? Kwa ni potila ndiritua shamba wapi? Si shamba ni ya wakamba? Si wakamba abada walipewa wa, wa, wa toe mining huko? Sirisha? Sasa wachana na wakamba wazalie huko. Ndiyo hata population ni kue mob. Ama aje? Mwenyezi Mungu awabariki. Uwe na nguvu. Tutakutana tena. Thank you so much. After watching Maina Njenga, you realize that uh, he is maybe an intelligent that has been appointed with someone. And this someone, they are being told that Uhuru Mege Kenyatta is so contented with whatever is going to happen in the next future general election. As there's a new brigade, they've not come out to relent. They've come out to realize that this time round, at least they have also another chance to stumble the Kenya Kwanzaa Brigade. As it is easy to ensure that they are going to take this, they must have all the ground tested and there's something that is being led by Maina Njenga you know Mount Kenya region with other Mount Kenya leaders when look at Kadonzo in Ukambani region also is there intact when look at Raila Odinga also in Nyanza region I want to say without any fear of contradiction is still intact when look at some part of coastal region we are still having people there who are seriously contented with Azimio Ramoja One Kenya Coalition. And they are ready, well packed. When it comes to Rift Valley, also Raila Odinga has never failed to have votes. This is something that is there. And also when you look at Western, the possibility is so high. So this secret card is, this time round, the players are going to be new. That is the possibility. The players of Azimio Ramoja One Kenya Coalition, they're going to be new. And as much as they are concerned, they're going to ensure that all these candidates that are going to be um, 
put on the ground, they must deliver. They must deliver on what the expectation of the Zimio is. I know some people are saying that William Ruti is going just to walk over in the next general election. It's not, go it's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy. For William Ruto to again get that seat, some people are saying that it is a walkover. But this is going to be a sweat to William Samuel Ruto. Because if any case is not going to do something impactful to the people of the Republic of Kenya, Kenyans have already understood that this man and his brigade are just lying to Kenyans. And that is what we know. So Maina Jenga came out telling us the truth. And this is the truth, and this is the truth that we have waited for. And as you are waiting that, oh, I don't think. Ladies and gentlemen, what happens?